Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. My name is Lynn Moffinson, and I want to welcome you to the International Workshop on HIV Pediatrics Virtual. My hardworking co-chairs are shown on this slide, Elaine Ebrins, Ted Rule, and Ann Petru, and I want to thank them for all the work they've put into remaking this meeting so that it can be done virtually. This slide shows the global nature of this workshop. This is our 12th workshop, originally scheduled for San Francisco, now being held virtually. So one of the advantages of having a virtual workshop is that more people are able to attend. And we have 402 attendees from 49 countries with representation from around the globe as shown. We're delighted that 103 attendees are young investigators and will be awarding a and best poster presentation to two of these young investigators at the end of the meeting. Now, this will be our first virtual meeting, and I do have to say I will miss being able to see everyone in person and engage in the networking and animated discussions that our meetings are known for. However, given the global COVID-19 pandemic, going virtual is necessary as it's been for CROI and for IAS. The meeting will have 29 oral abstract presentations and 73 video posters and four special session poster walks on selected topics led by members of our scientific committee. I wanna thank our sponsors both for their support of the workshop and also their commitment to pediatric HIV treatment and research. Vive and Gilead and Johnson & Johnson, Merck Sharp and Dome and Mylan. And we are very grateful to the support of NICHD and the Impact Network, which enabled us to offer 100 complimentary registrations for young investigators and low and middle income country attendees along with 94 internet data bubbles, bu bundles to facilitate attendance. So for the meeting, we will start with a global update on pediatric HIV and a talk about HIV cure research throughout the lifespan. This will be followed by two simultaneous abstract sessions, one on pediatric antiretrovirals, one on case finding and care. We'll then have a break during which poster presenters will be available for virtual questions and answers, followed by two clinical case presentations with discussants from around the globe, a presentation on whether undetectable equals untransmissible for breast milk HIV transmission with the commentary from women with HIV, and we'll end with four simultaneous poster tours led by scientific committee members. Tomorrow, there'll be a meet the expert breakfast meeting specifically for young investigators with various members of our scientific committee. The meeting itself will start with three plenary talks, disclosure in the North and South, prep in pregnancy and breastfeeding, and gaps and solutions for PMTCT, followed by three simultaneous oral abstract sessions on adolescence, PMTCT, or COVID-19, followed again by poster tea time. We'll end with a very exciting panel of talks on COVID-19 and children to wrap up the day, including a final talk by Tony Fauci on COVID-19 and vaccines that he just recorded, so it's up to date. And we'll then wrap up with the Young Investigator Awards. I want to acknowledge the workshop endorsements from multiple organizations concerned with HIV in children. And also to let you know that the meeting will be able to offer CME credits for those who are interested. Importantly, your feedback is critically important to planning the next meeting and you will receive a short survey following the meeting and I would urge you all to please respond. Now, shortly after each session, the recording from that session will be made available for streaming on the workshop portal. So you will have an opportunity to listen to all of the sessions. And after three weeks, these will be available to the broader public. We encourage you to ask questions at the end of the sessions through the chat function. And I would now like to introduce one of our co-chairs from San Francisco, Dr. Ted Rule. Thank you, Lynn. 
Uh, we'll turn now to Anne Petcher and I, because we wanted to give you a warm welcome uh, to what was supposed to be the first pediatric workshop in our area. Anne Petcher and her team are located in Oakland across the Bay and have been taking care of children with HIV since 1986. I'm based in San Francisco. I do some work globally and some work locally, but I actually got my first training with Anne in her clinic in 2006. Thank you, Ted. This has uh, been an interesting experience for all of us. It's been a tragic year, both globally and locally um, because of COVID, but also here we've had lightning storms. We've had horrendous fires. One day a, a month or so ago, we had a day that in the middle of the morning, it looked like this, an orange day in the Bay Area. Uh, so maybe it's better that we didn't have the meeting here, but we are really glad that we can participate now and we're happy to welcome you. We did want to highlight one thing on the program to make sure you didn't miss it. Um, there is a youth panel um, comprised of Marie, Fletcher, Sasha, and Joyce representing um, youth living with HIV from across the world. Um, for this section, um, which you'll find in the extended program, it might not be in some of the short versions, which is why I wanted to mention it. Um, you'll be able to watch a video that was produced by Chiva, and then it'll be followed by a mediated panel discussion um, thereafter uh, with each of the youth shown speaking. So hope you get a chance to look at it. It will be available on demand for the duration of the meeting and following. And with that, we wish to welcome you to this conference. We know that you're in many places in the world. It might be morning, afternoon, evening, or even night where you are. We hope you survive the jet lag. The struggle that we all face is real, dealing with COVID, dealing with HIV, and now dealing with virtual meetings that require us to do things at crazy hours of the day and night. We look forward to connecting virtually this year and hopefully in person as soon as we can down the road. So welcome to the HIV Pediatrics 2020. I hope you enjoy yourself and learn a lot. Welcome everyone.